So we'll start our first question. What is that is a square plus 10a plus 25. So how to write a square plus 10a plus 25 means so this one we have to write in the format of x into y two factors product of two factors we have to write like that. So a square you can write as a square only plus 10a keep for some time phi square we have to write in the format of some number square phi square is a perfect square for that we have to write phi 25 is a perfect square then you can write it as phi square so in the given expression plus plus will be given means that is definitely a plus b whole square formula only so 2 pluses will come means a plus b whole square formula then definitely we will get that one so for that what is that is a square plus 2ab plus b square so in the place of b in the place of a square a square is there in the place of b 5 is there 2 into a right as it is a again then into b means b is 5 here so b is 5 here then a is a only a is equals to a then b is equals to 5 then 2 a b we are written so 2 into 5 that is 10 a as a only then what you can write is a square plus 2 a b plus b square so a is equals to a and b is equals to for this a square plus 2 a b plus b square format is there for that what is that is a plus 5 whole square so what you can say a plus 5 into a plus 5 so a plus 5 into a plus 5 we got next question so what is our next one is second one l square minus 16 l plus 64 so if one thing one will be minus another one will be plus if it is a minus and plus means with the perfect square 64 is perfect square and l square is also perfect square remaining between we can whatever it's definitely a minus b whole square formula only what is that is a square minus 2ab plus b square if 1 plus 1 minus means that is definitely a minus b whole square formula will get so what is that a minus b whole square we are going to check so l square write it l square only minus 16l you will write 64 is we can write in the format of 8 square 8 square is 64 so we got then minus 2 into a is l b is 8 now you check 2 8 is 16 l l minus minus so it is in the format of a is equals to l then b is equals to 8 so it is in the format of a square minus 2 a b plus b square so for this what you will come is a plus b a minus b whole square that is l minus 8 whole square what is finally is l minus 8 into l minus 8 so that is the answer for second one next third one is so what is our third question is 36 x square plus 96 xy plus 64 y square so 64 y square so what you can write again is so here what is the 36 means can you write this into 6 square x square 6 square 36 then between we will write 96 xy only then 64 y square means 64 8 square y square can you write like that or not so here what is the formula we will get is a square b square means a b whole square you can write so 6x whole square plus 96xy plus 8y whole square then 6x means this is looking like plus plus means definitely we'll get a plus b whole square formula that is a is equals to 6x then b is equals to 8y 
then you can write this one 6x square whole 6x whole square plus 2 into a is what 6x b is what 8y plus 8y whole square so 6x b is equals to 8y plus plus a plus b whole square 2 6 are 12 12 8s are 96 x into y we got now now a plus b means 6 6x plus 8y whole square so what is the factors here 6x plus 8y into 6x plus 8y so like this we have to solve so in this question we are going to discuss what is that is 25x square plus 9y square minus 30xy so here one plus is there one minus is there for that definitely it may be a minus b whole square a square minus 2ab plus b square so here you can rearrange this value as 25x square minus 30xy plus 9y square so 25x square you can write in the format of 5 square into x square minus 30xy write like that only plus 3 square y square so y 9 9 become 3 square 3 3 is a 9 next our next one is so write this 5 square x square 5x whole square minus 30xy plus 3y whole square now you can see a square that is a is equals to 5x then b is equals to 3y now we are going to check 5x whole square minus 2 into a will be 5x into b will be 3y plus 3y whole square so what is this now here you can check a square minus 2ab plus b square so here 2 5 is a 10 10 3 is a 30 x into y 30 x y minus we got then what you can write is 5x minus 3y whole square because a minus b whole square formula so here what you can write 5x minus 3y into 5x minus 3y so this is the way to factorize the given expression so our next one fifth one is so what is fifth one 25 m square minus 40 m n plus 16 n square so here also they are given 1 plus 1 minus it might be definitely it should be it will be what is that so it will be a minus b whole square formula so 1 minus minus so 25 m square you can write 5 square m square minus 40 m n write like that only 16 means 4 square n square so 5 m whole square minus you can write this as 2 into 5 m into 4 n plus 4 n whole square so 2 5 is a 10, 10 4 is a 40, m into n that is mn. So here a is equals to 5m, b is equals to 4n. So a is equals to 5n, b is equals to 4m, 4n. So you can write this is the format of a square minus 2a, 2ab plus b square. So what you can write 5m minus 4n whole square. So what is final final one? Final answer is 5m minus 4n into 5m minus 4n. So that value will get. Next, our sixth one is. So in this expression, they are given again minus plus. It's it will be definitely a minus b whole square formula. As I told, if one plus one minus, they will give. That is definitely a minus b formula only a minus b whole square formula so 81 x square you can write in the format of 9 square x square so 9 9 is a 81 you write 198 xy like that only plus 121 you can write in the format of 11 square y square then 9 x whole square you can take for both product whole square this one 198 xy 
plus 11y whole square then what you can write here is so that they are given we got it as a will be equal to 9x then b will be equal to 11y then you can write to a b right so 9x whole square minus 2 into a is 9x into b will be 11y plus 11y whole square so here two nines are 18 18 11 so will get 198 definitely x into y so like that we can divide this given expression now what you will do is here so a 9x minus 11y whole square so for this can you write like this or not why because a minus b whole square is equals to a square minus 2ab plus b square so you can write 9x minus 11y into 9x minus 11y so this is the way to factorize the given expression next our seventh one is x plus y whole square minus 4xy maybe you will get x minus y whole square formula that is a plus b into a minus b so here expand x plus y whole square means s square plus 2xy plus y square so a plus b whole square is a square plus 2ab plus b square minus 4xy so x square 2xy minus 4xy right one side 2xy minus 4xy plus y square so x square 2 minus 4 will be minus 2 xy is a common plus y square so it is came like a square minus 2ab plus b square that is x minus y whole square finally this is important formula we have to remember this case this is important x minus y whole square you can write in the format of x plus y whole square minus 4xy this is very very important we have to remember this compulsory next our next one is eighth one what is the eighth question is l power 4 plus 4 l square m square plus 4 m power 4 so for this case what we will get answer is so l for 4 you can write in the format of l square whole square plus 4 l square m square write like that only plus 2 4 you can write in the format of 2 square m square you can write in the format of m square m power 4 you can write in the format of m square whole square next our next step l square whole square plus this one divided into 2 into 2 l square m square plus 2 square m square whole square so for from all these cases you can take a will be equal to l square b will be equal to 2 m square how means let's write l square whole square plus 2 into 2 l square m square plus you can take common of 2 and m square here 2 2 will will take whole square next so what formula you are getting plus plus means is definitely a plus b whole square formula so a will be l square then b will be 2 m square so here l square multiplied and 2 m square is also there with the 2 a b right a plus b a is l square b will be 2 m square whole square then a plus b whole square that is l square plus 2 m square into l square plus 2 m square so this is the way to factorize the given expression thanks for watching i am sure you will get subscription from us and please share